I've never met a person who was not successful that didn't have a great amount of self-discipline within their life. Self-discipline and being able to perform and being able to keep your life on schedule and being able to keep commitments and promises and meet deadlines is essential to success. Good morning, good evening, good afternoon, everybody. Happy Monday, July 13th. Hope everybody's doing well in a good place in a safe space as always. Hope you have a wonderful weekend. I know I did here on Jay's Chronicles back at you one more time. I love, love, loved last week. I hope you all loved last week as much as I did. We had a great week talking about discipline and the importance of discipline. You know, as we, before we get into the message for today, I think about discipline. I really wish people would be more disciplined with adhering to the safety laws that we're having in place to really put kicking the COVID-19 in the face. We have no discipline across the United States, to say the least, with COVID-19. We act as though it is impenetrable, that it cannot kill us, that we can't get sick. I don't understand, ladies and gentlemen, will you please enforce more discipline when it comes to COVID-19. Don't let it sneak up on you because people are getting too comfortable in these uncomfortable environments and it's really starting to bother me. Stay home, stay masked up, do the proper things. This is impacting us for far too long and it's because we are being not disciplined with how we are supposed to take care of ourselves and our environment. So I'll stop, I'll stop there, but I wanna continue moving forward to understand what's the difference between discipline and commitment. We've spent the last few weeks talking about action, getting rid of our butts, getting off our butts, understanding what's required to be disciplined in various areas within our life, but that's just not enough. We still need some other pieces to the puzzle. And this week we're gonna talk about one of them. It's called commitment. But before we talk about commitment, I want you to understand what's the difference between discipline and commitment. Have you ever thought of that question? What's the difference between discipline and commitment? So my understanding and for me is discipline is the difference between uh, going from something that's bad to something good. Discipline is very transformative. But commitment is required in order for you to achieve something. You understand that? So commitment is more transactional. Discipline is more transformational, if that makes sense. You can have all the discipline in the world, but until you commit to something, make a commitment, it cannot be accomplished. The two of them have to come together in a marriage to really be, reach success. The people that have discipline plus commitment have success. Many of you know I love real estate. I've been searching and searching for a house. I've had a lot of discipline over the last year, meeting with my realtor, making sure that we go out on a weekly basis to look at houses. I'm on the internet doing all the things that are required, having discipline when you're out house shopping but it's not until I commit to a contract, the transactional piece, will I obtain that house. Until I make the commitment, until I show up to somebody's doorstep with a pre-approval letter saying, I have funds to purchase this property. I can have all the discipline in the world, but the seller of that property is not gonna care until I show them some paperwork. When you think about commitment, I want you to think about paper, writing it down. We're gonna talk about that this week. But I'm just giving you the trailer to the movie this week. We're gonna talk about some great topics focused on commitment. Because again, a lot of you say you wanna to get to the top, but are you willing to commit to get to the top? We're gonna to find out this week. I look forward to seeing you this week. We're going to see how much commitment you got, and I can't wait. You take care, everybody. Get you some. I'll see you tomorrow. I've never met a person who was not successful that didn't have a great amount of self-discipline within their life. 
self-discipline and being able to perform and being able to keep your life on schedule and being able to keep commitments and promises and meet deadlines is essential to success.